Hey, Bolo Buddies, thanks for watching. Okay, so I made over $700 in one day doing this. And you can do this too. This can happen to you. All right, so I am in this Facebook group and the Facebook group is ran by Prime Time Treasure Hunter, Donna Crone. And let me pull up my screen share here. Okay. So I'm going to show you the group because you definitely need to go join and I'm going to tell you how to get involved so that you can possibly be picked in the future for this amazing event. Okay. Um, so this is the Facebook group. It's the Reselling Resource Center. This is the banner at the top. I'm keeping everything else kind of hidden just because it is a private group. So. Um, there are 19,639 members, almost 20,000. So again, be sure to go down and um, I'll put a link in the description of the video and you guys can go down and join this group. All right. So here is how it works. It's support that seller Sunday. So Dominic picks one person from his Facebook group for each Sunday. Every Sunday, it's different. And it says in this event, we use the combined power of over 19,000 group members to support one member with as many sales as possible. The seller is normally not chosen at random, but is based on the interaction. I'm sorry, their interaction in the group, support of my YouTube channel and Instagram channels, eBay store and other considerations. So basically you're involved and I shout Primetime Treasure Hunter out all the time because I love his channel. I think it's fantastic. And he's become a great friend of mine. Just he's been a mentor to me, really. He's helped me with like YouTube questions and he's just given me guidance and good, positive role model. Great support. You never hear him say anything bad about anyone. He's just a great person. So I shout him out all the time because I think he's fantastic. Not because I thought I was going to get support that seller. However, if you want to try and get support that seller that way, go for it because it could happen because that's what it's based on. It's based on supporting him and, you know, leaving comments on his YouTube, being active in his Facebook group, his Instagram, stuff like that. So definitely go check that out. Um, so basically what he does is he posts this post in his Facebook group and everybody that's in his Facebook group knows that this is coming every Sunday. So then everyone that wants to contribute or be a part of the um, event, they go in and they buy something from the person being featured. So he has my link here and then people go in and buy something and then they put a screenshot down in the comments. I keep track of my number of sales and um, how much everything sold for. So then on Sunday night or Monday morning, I send him a picture of my items, which let's see, $711 and 78 cents with 39 sales. So I sent him my picture and then he creates this little post and it tells everyone how well the person did on that Sunday, which is awesome. It's super exciting. Everybody gets involved. Um, I purchase from the Support That Seller Sunday often. I don't do it all the time. I mean, nobody can afford to do it all the time. However, I think that Dominic buys from every person every Sunday. So he is, you know, he's putting money out also, which he's just a great person. So check out his Facebook group. And then here is his YouTube channel. And it says he's live because I had this up earlier. I was watching his ching -a -thon right here. And it's another seller supporting seller. So you go over to his YouTube channel and essentially people, he'll put two people's um, eBay links and then the first one to sell it goes on to the next round and the person who bought it gets pulled up and then it just keeps going. And tonight he did it so that um, they had to sell at least a hundred dollars during the whole entire event. So he just does tons of support that seller like events. I mean, this is just another example, his live show. And that's um, Wednesday night. I think he's doing that once a month at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So definitely check that out. I also will post a link down in the description of the video.
for his YouTube channel. And you can see he's got tons and tons of great content. Um, he does thrift battles where he gets two um, resellers and they compete against each other, which is super fun. And I was actually one of his guests a long time ago against uh, Donatella Bodolino. So you guys will have to go watch that video to see who won. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to take you into, um, I'm going to show you what I sold. You guys know I love doing what sold videos. So I'm going to show you what sold. I'm not going to go over like where I got it, what I paid for it or anything like that, because I'm already five minutes into the video. This is more about, I want you guys to see what this event is about. And I want you guys to go get involved so that you can get picked to be support that seller Sunday. The person, I don't know what it's called. The person picked. All right, let's see what I sold. All right. The first item I sold was to primetime treasure hunter himself. He bought this um, Hasbro Star Wars destroyer droid and I don't, he, he paid full asking price of $11 and 48 cents and, um, buyer pays shipping. And I also sent him a couple little, um, a little gift. And if you guys want to see what that is, you can, uh, you can go watch the replay of his cha ching -a -thon, uh, because he shared it at the beginning of the video. So you can check that out there. All right. The next item. I sold was this really cool, it's a cardboard um, coaster like that you sit your drink on and it's a ring sizer. So you basically like stick your finger through the hole and it tells you what size ring you wear, which is, I don't know, it's fun. And I, I believe this sold for full asking price also. The next item I sold is this, the best of charades for kids game. And I believe this went for full asking price of $12.75 $12 plus shipping. The next item I sold were these Sesame Street white, oh my gosh, white, write and wipe workbook dry erase number colors. And um, the same person bought both of these items. So that was really kind. Thank you. I want to say thank you to everyone that bought something from me. I appreciate the support so much. You guys have no idea. It just, it means so much to me. And I just want to say thank you. So we're going to keep going here. The next item, I sold this to um, another uh, person who subscribed to my channel. And it is an Under Armour men's polo shirt, size extra large. And it did have some imperfections. And I was like, oh my gosh, you know how you get that feeling where you're like, I don't want somebody to be disappointed. And, you know, so I sent him a um, message and I'm like, hey, uh, you, did you read that? Because I didn't know if he just kind of like got it real quick and didn't really read the description. And I'll show you. It's just got like little imperfection and, and it's the material of the shirt. And I probably shouldn't even have listed it. And I'm feeling like really guilty, you know, and he's like, no, no, I want it. And I'm like, are you sure? So anyway, Midwest Picker, thank you so much for your purchase. I hope it's okay to shout you out. Um, but yes, he bought this and then I threw in an extra shirt just because I felt bad. <laughs> I was like, I hope he, I hope, I mean, I showed him pictures, but you know, okay, going on to the next item. So he did get a extra shirt. So the next item are these um, holiday treat boxes and there are six in each pack. So there's a total of 12 and I believe they bought this set and this set and I still have two left here and I have five left here. So if anybody needs any treat boxes, you know where to find them. My link's down below. <laughs> All right. The next item is this Lane Bryant sweater, which I also have multiples of. And I have all of the sizes available. I have different colors available. So if you need a sweater, I got you covered. So someone bought this. And then I sold one of my cat's meow little, um, oh, what do you call them? They're like shelf sitters. And this one's super cute. It was in excellent condition. And I think it was more of a rare item. I couldn't find any other ones on eBay. So um, yeah, very cool. People collect these and they're nice. Like this one's kind of Christmassy, has that, you know, winter look to it. Super cute. 
Um, I sold this other cat's meow, and this one is not in great condition. So I'm hoping that the buyer actually like looked at the photos and I almost didn't list this one. And I'm like, you know what? What if somebody is like lives in Pennsylvania or is looking for this particular one? And this is the one they bought. So I don't know if there's a story behind that or if they were just buying something to support me. I'm not sure. But that one sold. And this sweater sold. And the person said that they were buying it as a gift for their son. And it's a Tricot St. Raphael sweater. And it's new with tags. It retails for $60. And I sold that for $13.13 .13 plus shipping. I believe they just bought that and did not make an offer. The next item is this express headband. And I want to give a shout out to Profit Monsters because his mom bought this from me. And um, she had to change her address. And we got to talking. And she's like, I'm Profit Monsters, mom. I'm like, oh my gosh, he's fantastic. So a shout out to Profit Monsters go check out his channel. The next one is this vintage Blatt's beer tap. And I bought a bunch of beer taps at a garage sale. And it was kind of like I felt like I paid more than I would normally pay for things like this. And you guys know me. So I kind of paid up for these. And this is my last one. So I just sold my last one. So that feels good to be like, I sold all the beer taps. I wasn't sure how they would do. And I did all right. All right. The next item are these earrings. And these are from my bulk buy. I bought it on eBay to sell on eBay. And if you guys want to check out that series, I bought 344 pounds of jewelry. And I have a whole video series on it. If you guys would like to check that out, that is on my channel. The next item is this Moen. Um, they're like thread strips for your tub so you don't slip. Sold these and they're new in the package for $8.50 plus shipping. I sold these Wrangler shorts and this sports bra uh, to the same person. And I believe they added it to their cart. So when you add items to your cart, especially clothing items, it becomes buy one, get one 10% off. And you get the discounted shipping of $5. So here's another brawl that I sold. And I was surprised that people were buying brawls because you have to like screenshot and put what you bought in the comments. And they're like, hey, I got a brawl. So that's awesome. So I sold this brawl. And it's a Cacique brawl. And Cacique does great. It's new with tags. Um, these are new brawls. They're not pre-owned. The next item I sold was this vintage Halloween TJ's Restaurants Fun Book. And the guy that bought it, um, he said that he collects Halloween stuff. And I did not put in the notes section where it was. And I was like panicking, thinking, oh my gosh, I'm going to have to cancel the order. And then I remembered where it was. So I was so happy that I found it. But it's super cool. It's just a menu from a restaurant, a local restaurant. but. Um, it's got the real neat, cute graphic on the front. So pretty cool. I think that's called, would that be considered ephemera? I used to say it like ephemera or something. I said it all wrong, but I think I say it right now, ephemera. Because you guys in the chat, in the comments, always helped me pronounce things. And I think I say it right now, ephemera. Am I right? All right. Uh, this Disney Frozen watch and... I just listed this right before the event because I was thinking, okay, I need to list some things that are new because Christmas is coming. So this actually sold really fast. I do have another one listed that has Elsa and Anna on it. That's super cute with a white band. So if anyone's interested, my link is down below. The next item sold to Flippin' Particles. And this is a vintage hand-blown glass dragon, which is super cool. And she also has a reseller channel. So definitely go check out Flippin' Particles. I sold this Lane Bryant shirt. And it, um, gosh, I've had this a while. And the reason is, is because I bought a whole bunch of them. And I mean a bunch. And I'm almost, this might have been my last one. I'm not 100% sure. I might have another one listed. But um, yeah, I've got lots of Lane Bryant in my store. I sold these earrings, these blue dangle drop earrings. And these were also a part of my, I bought it on eBay to sell on eBay bulk buy. I sold this sweater, this sweater, 
and this sweater to one person. So that was awesome. And they're Lane Bryant sweaters and they're new without tags. I sold this pin and I'm going to give you a little backstory on this. So I was in auctions for use live show and she shouted out that I was support that seller Sunday. And then one of the guys in the chat, and I don't know if he wants his name mentioned, so I won't say it just in case. Actually, I don't think he'll care. It's Farmer77. And he was like, everybody go support Courtney. And he was like, just super supportive. And he came over and he bundled this item, this item, and this item. So thank you, Farmer77. You are always so supportive. He has bought from me before and he's just a, a great person. And T from Auctions for You, thank you so much for shouting out um, the event and shouting out Primetime Treasure Hunter. That was awesome of you. And everybody go check out Auctions for You also. She has um, YouTube auctions and they have great items for resellers. The next item is this Livy Active hat. And I have four more and I have, um, I have another style also. It's the same type of beanie with the pom-pom on the top, but it's different colors. So if anybody needs a winter hat, my link is down below. It's $10.20 or best offer with $5.90 shipping. Or I think shipping depends on where you live. So, and then I, so the person that bought the hat also bought the OxyClean. So, and this was new and sealed. So thank you again, everyone who made a purchase and we are still going strong here. I sold these earrings, which are super cute. And these were from my bulk buy. I bought it on eBay to sell on eBay. And so were these, these little owl earrings, super cute. And then I sold this Disney parks. It's like one of those pullback trains and um, it still had on like the the tag. And this is like a harder to find discontinued item. So you can see the original price was $7.95. And if you're a reseller, you know that when items are discontinued or retired, the value of the item goes up instead of down. So I did sell this. And I think I, I sent out an offer on this one. The person liked it. And then I sent an offer. I can't remember for how much. The next item is this Rudolph Misfit Toys. Um, it's from 2003. Again, it's a harder to find item. I did take a um, best offer on this because it was somebody from our, um, our RC, Reselling Resource Center. So if you guys ever want to make a purchase from me and you're making an offer, please put Bolo Buddies in the, the notes so that I know you're somebody from the channel, a subscriber. So the next item is this Victoria's Secret Brawl. And I showed the back because the back is much cooler than the front. And I have, oh, I have tons of Victoria's Secret. So if you need Victoria's Secret brawl, down in the description of the video is my link. I sold this uh, keepsake Hallmark ornament and it's got the original box. It's super cute. It's like a Lego Santa deal from 1994. How cool is that? And I sold another Victoria's Secret brawl and I took a best offer on this. I can't remember for how much, but um, it's really pretty. And then I sold these Calvin Klein jeans and they're girls size four new with tags. And I have seven pair left if anyone's interested. And I also sold this Superman three piece bodysuit. All right, guys. So again, head on. Oh, I'm sorry. One more from Mercari. I sold this uh, brawl. The person asked me, um, they saw it on eBay and asked me if I had it on Mercari and I did. So I sent them the link and then um, they were able to just screenshot the picture and put it into the group. So very cool. So head on over to the Reselling Resource Center. Definitely get involved. And it, this could be you, you guys. And $11.78, guys, in one day. I sold 39 things. Literally, I was shipping all day. And again, Primetime Treasure Hunter on YouTube. So links will be down in the description of the video. Thank you guys all so much for watching. Go get involved. I hope that you're the next Support That Seller Sunday person. 
because it can happen. So thanks for watching.